So the name Jay Sean Augusto is no longer a common one in the mouths of basketball fans all over the world. But the thing is, 10 years ago, this basketball prodigy went viral. This guy was considered to be the best 11 year old basketball player on the planet. But very little has been heard of him since. There was videos of his workouts, of his work ethic at 11, 12 years old. And people thought that he was destined for NBA stardom. At the same time, equally as many people would comment on these videos talking about how he wasn't going to make it and how his parents were helicopter parents pushing him to do all the work. But what has happened since then? What has happened since the viral videos, since the TV performances? In this video, I'm going to be doing Jay Sean Augusto, the best 11 year old on the planet. Where is he now? So Jay Sean Augusto was probably the best fifth grade player in the nation nearly 10 years ago. As the years went on, he was still a very good player, being one of the best point guards in middle school when he was 13, 14 years old. But as the years went on, he didn't physically grow as much as a lot of NBA prospects, finishing his growing at 5 foot 11. Jay Sean Augusto started high school in 2012. He was at Garfield High School and was actually a four year starter there. And he also won two state championships in them four years and was also a three star recruit coming out of high school. Which while it's not spectacular, it's not what some people expected him to be, it's nowhere near the best in his high school class, it's better than an awful lot of child prodigies. Especially in basketball because no matter how hard you work, if you don't win the genetic lottery, if you're not naturally big enough, you're not naturally strong enough or fast enough, you're not going to make the NBA. There's a lot of players that aren't as skilled as other players that are just physically more capable of playing in the NBA and that's why they get picked over other players. You may say someone like Steph Curry, but Steph Curry while not an elite athlete at an NBA level, is still an elite athlete. And he is 6'3", which is 4 inches bigger than someone like Jay Sean Augusto. And Isaiah Thomas is incredibly, incredibly quick. So even though he is 5'9", he can get away with it. Throughout high school, Jay Sean Augusto worked extremely hard on his game. And this is a quote. I've had fun. It's just my fun isn't like everyone else's. After we won state last year, people were partying after they won. After state for me, the next day, I was like, Back at another one, let me put in some work. That was my fun. So Jay Sean Augusto was obsessed with basketball. Even as a kid, he was obsessed. And as he got older, he still continued to work hard. Which is the reason he did land a D1 scholarship to LIU Brooklyn. So that was the end of his high school career. Nine years after the viral video, where he was considered to be the best player his age in the world, he was only a three-star recruit. No one knew who Jay Sean Augusto was, and the only time he was ever mentioned in any basketball conversation is when people are asking, what happened to that 11-year-old that went viral 10 years ago? And now I'm gonna talk about where he is now. So last year was Jay Sean Augusto's freshman year for the LYU Brooklyn Blackbirds. He actually ended up being a starter for the team, averaging 11.2 points per game, which is extremely good, in 33 minutes per game. He shot 42% from the field and shot nearly 37% from three. Also averaged two rebounds, three assists per game, which is quite good. Surprisingly enough, he actually declared for the 2017 NBA draft. I'm not entirely sure why he declared for the draft. He was in a small school. And it's very rare that a player gets drafted from a small school, from a small conference after their freshman year. It's very, it's very few one and dones in that situation. Of course, Jay Sean Augusto went undrafted in the 2017 NBA draft. But the thing is, he didn't hire an agent, which with new draft rules actually meant that he was allowed to go back and play for the LYU Blackbirds for another year. So the question is, will we ever see Jay Sean Augusto in the NBA? The only answer I can give is, I don't know. His coaches thought he was ready to go to the NBA draft, obviously no NBA teams thought that he was ready and no one drafted him, but you just never know. Will a team give him a chance based on the potential they may have saw 10 years ago? I don't know. Will a team get him as a publicity stunt? Possibly. Or will, after 3-4 years in college, will he make the NBA by merit? Will he play well enough in college that NBA scouts can't ignore him? Again, these are questions that are left to be answered. So that's it, that is where Jay Sean Augusto is now. He seemed to fall off the face of the earth for a few years, but in that time he continued to work hard, and while he's not the prodigy, he's not 
a superstar high school player, he's not a superstar college player. He had a great high school career winning two state championships and is currently playing Division 1 basketball and still has the dream of making the NBA and is continuously working towards it. So anyway, that's the video. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe.